So if you've ever tried to print a binary file into the terminal or you know accidentally printed a binary file or a non-text file with like random characters um, you might have broken your terminal and the reason for that probably is that the characters you are printing it's interpreted by the terminal as actual you know as actual actions or something like w here we have ASCII 8 which is backspace and then you know some weird stuff here but uh, well the point is you might not actually want to print a binary file right let's say you are trying to recursively grab something from some directory and you know in that directory there m may be some uh, non-text files and you may not want to print that because you know it will break your terminal so uh, like here we don't actually want ASCII 0 to 31 right well you have uh, backspace and new line here but let's say we're trying to grab something right we don't really want that if we're trying to grab a text file right so what you can do is just uh, make a macro where you have all the you know you have all the things you don't want right and of course ex exclude new line and tab right because you probably want them and maybe include null or something I don't know but um, yeah well let's include it I don't know maybe not but uh, what you can do is when you read the file you can just let's see or actually I don't know why I'm using while loop use a switch alright and then when we encounter a character we don't necessarily want we'll just break right or you know return or something and then otherwise print or something and you know and a file return right so now if you're trying to recursively grab something from some directory it's not going to print characters that may break the terminal but uh, if you have a better solution do let me know because we are reading through the whole file here so yeah